Hey everybody, I'm Ace Trinilium and welcome to episode 11 of my Pokemon Soul Silver Randomizer Quad Lock. We're in Azalea Town and we just whooped the gym leader's ass. Well, almost. The gym leader didn't whip our ass, but I don't know what I'm talking about. Yay, video! Okay, best intro ever. Let's do some shout outs because I have over 2,000 to get through. And I had a message just today saying, hey, I subscribed today. Where's my shout out? I'm sorry, you're going to have to get in line. There are people who have probably been subscribed to me like two months and I haven't got around to doing their subscription shout out yet because there are just so many. And my email on my phone really hates me. So we've got Chili T, Daniel, Max Rose, Jimmy K08, Soto Peter, Amanda. It just refreshed on me again. God damn it. It just doesn't want me to read anything and it's crashed. This is so successful. We'll do some more shout outs in a bit when my phone decides it's alive. Cool. Um, where am I going? I say that all the time. D didn't I give Kurt some shit to do? I think I did. Ah, Liam, I just finished your Pokeball. Here. It's a friend ball. Yay. You have apricorns for me? Yeah, you, you can have my black apricorn. Two of them. Okay, I'll come back tomorrow. Nope, emails are dead. Emails are super dead. Maybe I need to find a different way to sort my shout outs out. Because I want to give you guys shout outs, and I know some of you guys are probably only here for shout outs. But, you know, life. Okay, let's continue. Now, someone brought to my attention that if I go see Professor Elm, which, yes, I know is all the way back where we came from, but if I go see Professor Elm, he will give me, if I show him the Togepi that we caught, he will give me an Everstone in the normal game. But because I have items randomized, perhaps it will not be an Everstone. Oh. <laughs> okay, let's just, let's just get through this cave. Oh, it's a Cherubi. But then we'll come back and continue. But it's good for the story to go and show Professor Elm the Pokemon that he wants to see. Grind. I don't want it to be a grind fest, to be honest. But then again, I don't want to run from everything because, you know, we need some leveling. You know, one of these days, we're going to have to fight someone really tough and we're going to get creamed. Come on. Although, to be fair, I think Zanzibar... I don't think Zanzibar needs to be at the front of the party. I don't think that is a requirement. I think he just needs to be in the party. So, let's give Bellatrix the front of the party. Damn! Let's just blitz through it, Bellatrix. You know you can do it with that goddamn vice grip. Oh my god, she's beautiful. Sexiest corefish we have ever seen. There we go. Okay, don't sprint, because sprinting... I was going to say sprinting gives us battles quicker, but... This cave doesn't seem to care about that. So, let's see. If we can escape the cave. This thing's going to kill us if it wants to use Absorb on us, but... Oh, look, it died! Oh, Bellatrix, you're so awesome. Damn! I do think there are some fishing locations that we've missed as well. So we could probably go and check those out while we're on our little adventure. Come on, to the exit! To the exit! Ooh, to the exit! Yeah! That is how it's done, kids! Uh, okay, we fished here. Oh, we're doing well. We didn't fish. 
at the ruins of Alf, which is this way. This way. This way? This way. It's definitely one of these ways. Ooh, we can take out a Lavatar with a bubbly bubble. And away it goes. So yeah, let's let's check the ruins. Because I'm sure there's water in the ruins. Someone someone said the ruins of Alf and Dark Cave have water that I can access. I know I said I wasn't gonna, but I kinda want to. Because I love fishing. I don't love fishing in real life. In real life, I find fishing incredibly boring. But, and, you know, let's just see what's there. I'll tell you what we'll do. We'll just have one encounter. And if it's not something eligible, we'll we'll leave and come back with a good rod. It's a shuppet, which is not eligible, but is killable. Damn nightshade. Okay, that's our one encounter here. Let's let's leave and never come back. No, we'll come back. We'll come back with a super rod, and everything will be hunky dory. We hit another milestone yesterday. Well, not really. Well, it is a milestone, technically, but not like conventional milestone. We hit 7,000 subscribers. So thank you guys for your ongoing, super duper, continued support. I love you guys. And I love having you guys with me on my adventures, currently in Johto. But we've been all over the place in the last few months. So we've got Dark Cave over here, right? And I bet you're getting so mad that I'm just ignoring these apricorns, but hey-ho! Oh, I love the music in here. Let's just use... let's not even use Flash. Oh, Diglett! Now, some of you are probably shouting at the screen to just use goddamn flash, but no. Water! There we go. One encounter. Not even a nibble. Oops. Yep, I can't fish into rocks. That's definitely true. Oh, really? Come on. I was about to say this water's defective, but here we go. It's a bug type. It does evolve into a flying type. So we, we could argue that I do have to catch it. But... Nope. Because the thing is, we've already got one of these, and it's not fun. I'm quite happy with my bee drill. Do over. We'll come back with a good rod. Maybe I'll make up a rule where the good rod is a new area. No, just kidding. But I'm not counting the caterpie. I, like I said in many an episode, if there's a Pokemon where its eligibility is questionable because it evolves into something that is eligible or evolves from something that is eligible. I call discretion on it and I, I feel like I can choose. Because, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm pretty in charge of this thing, right? I think. I've fished in that water, haven't I? Probably. Probably for days and hours. Right, here's Cherry Grove. So we're closing in on Professor Professor's house where he carries out his profession of professing okay here's a fun drinking game for the people that are old enough to drink to watch this take a shot every time I say okay you will not make it to the end my friend okay let's go okay okay hey Elmy face Liam, I thought the egg hatched. Where's the Pokemon? Oh, sorry, I dumped it. Oopsie. 
Yeah, let's let's heal. It's not really what I had in mind. Can I access the Pokemon storage system? Let's just take a moment to just laugh at how amazing Bellatrix is when she runs after me when I run downwards. With the freaking claws in the air. Bellatrix! So cool. I feel bad because I'm kind of neglecting Aqua Ace. Hey, there's my mum, but I'm going to ignore her. Oh, look, mum, I'm here. No, I'm not. I'm still away on my adventure. Oh, I can only... Oh, bugger. I have to go back to bloody... Oh, look, you're just teasing mum now. These stairs are so weirdly arranged. It doesn't make a lot of sense, but okay. Slight sidetrack. We need to go to Cherry Grove. Because that's where the nearest pe As if I have to go to the next town. What kind of age are we living in? I have to go over to the next town to use the computer. Oh, Glitch City, bitch. Glitch, Glitch City, bitch. Just me, my Pokemon, and Bellatrix, bitch. Well, this is exciting. Apparently this is a common fault with emulators of Pokemon Heart Gold and Soul Silver, but it tends to fix itself, so no biggie. I'm just happy to play the game. See, there we are. Zigzagoon. There we go. Right. Cherry freaking Grove. Oh, God, do we really have to go all this way? Damn it. A lot of you guys have commented on the fact that I kind of appear lost when I run around this game. It's because I last played it like five years ago and I just don't remember it. Oh, I just healed. Why did I do that? Oh, hurry up, Joy. Stop making me pay for my blunders. Okay. Let's use the PC. So just for the time being, we'll put... I can't remember. It's on the screen, Johto. It's the name of the freaking region, you dumbass. Yeah, my bad. And we'll take out our Togepi, which if you remember, I changed the name to Felicia because I had to redo that bit where we got the egg to hatch. Hey ho, hey ho, hey ho. Oh my days. Now, this item better be worth it. I really have a feeling that I'm going to get something ridiculous like soft sand. Or even Max Potion. Max Potions aren't bad, but I always never want to use them. I just realised I don't need to press the run button to run because I have the running shoes permanently selected. Stupid boy. Okay. Now. Elm! Here's the damn Pokemon. I thought the egg had... Oh, for frigging hell's sake, you stupid man. Right. Can't I just show him the Pokedex? Sorry, Bellatrix, you got to make way for this stupid little thing. What? A Pokemon? Hmm, as far as I know, there's not a Pokemon like this in Johto, just like Mr. Pokemon was seeing over the phone. Legendary Pokemon could be... Oh, never mind. Anyway, I'm sure things will be happening around you, Liam. You're making me all excited. Uh-oh. I'll give you a present for that. Uh-oh. Please take it. Oh, it is an Everstone. I suppose you can't randomise that. The Pokemon changes its shape as it evolves, but it's holding Everstone... Don't forget about my research. That was a complete exercise in futility. Damn it, with this stupid Togepi face. Let's just make it to Cherry Grove in one piece. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, good. I could just let Felicia die right now. That'd be fun. But I'm not like that. Sting ass will do it. Sting ass will twin needle everything to death. She doesn't even need two hits.
Right, you can be dumped until needed. Because I want my damn crawfish back. You'll... What did I do? I did it wrong. Because I'm rushing. My crawfish was not in the machine. <laughs> in the PC. So... I will definitely have my crawfish back, thank you. And I will definitely have my tailo back. Now is the time. Now I want my crawfish at the front. Oh, this is going bothersomely. Pokemon. There we go. Oh, Caesar's a war turtle, I just remembered. Yeah, I'm not even gonna change the Pokemon in the bit where I take the egg to the professor, the Togepi to the professor, because, you know, it's lazy. That's what I do. Skitty, let's kill its face with bubbles. Now we can continue on our merry way. If we can ever get back to where we were. This is how we do it. We'll just spam bubble until we can get back to Azalea Town. Am I going the right way? I never know if I'm going the right way. Why do you want to use helping hand when you're on your own? Okay, we, we did go the wrong way. Because I'm just so rubbish at the Johto map. But at least we're going to get a nice level up for Bellatrix pretty soon. Oh my god, this is, this is the worst of wrong turns ever. Yay, level 18! Oh my god! I literally could not have gone a more wrong way. Why did nobody tell me? Why were none of you yelling at the screen that I'd gone the wrong way? Just, you know, I need the support, guys. Honest. Let's do this. Oh, I can't even get past a freaking hedge. Not a hedge, a ledge. Close to a ledge, but just a hedge. Hedge, hedge, ledge, hedge. Ledge. Hedge. We are almost where we need to be. <laughs> he says. We still got that stupid cave. Oh, this was such a such a waste of a detour. I appreciate you guys always trying to help me, but I wish I hadn't gone back for that Everstone. This isn't Gen 6. I don't need it for my frogadier. Lol lol lol. Hmm. South. Not this south, the next south. I almost remembered. Give Liam a little bit of credit. This is it. So down here, there is a cave. Or another battle. Ooh, Carvana. There's something I would have liked to catch. Well, <laughs> what are we going to do? I can't believe I've wasted the better part of an episode to get an Everstone. I'm disappointed, to say the least. Oh well. Live and learn. At least it's got Bellatrix from nice leveling up. I might be nice and treat you guys and just, just keep going and going and going until I die. Of starvation. But then how would I upload it? Hmm. I have to write that in my will. Please upload my last quad lock. Come 
Come on. Oh my god, he's the Pokemon version of Usain Bolt. Nope. Spinarak, get off my property. Bubble will kill you. Just need to make it that little bit further. Oh, let me just sip some tea because I'm so British. I will in a minute. Too into getting out of this cave. There we go. Okay, Route 33. Now it puts us at Azalea Town. Beautiful. I'm gonna buy some potion. And then maybe we'll check out what Pokemon are on the next route. Bagger off, Ralph. I'm not answering for Ralph. He always rings at the most inopportune times. We have lots of potions available. I think 13 to go with our six would be sufficient. Oh, that creeped me out. That old guy just stand in there. Heal. Going to a new route must heal. I'd love to rest my Pokemon. Awesome! Right. Let's go catch us a Pokemon. What? Oh, bollocks. That's Poo Hole. Tell me something, is it true the Team Rocket has returned? What, you beat them? <laughs> Quit lying. Are you serious? Then let's see how good you are. Oh shit, I've got to fight Poo Face. Poo Face? Poo Head? Poo Hole. I forgot my own rival's name, but then so does like Professor Oak. Rival Poo Hole. Oh no. Bellatrix, you must kill this. Bellatrix, you must kill this or it will self-destruct. Oh, <sighs> Bellatrix, you beast. Oh yes. Tricks. So good. You're about to send in Lombre. Yeah, well, things are going to go a little bit differently for your Lombre this time. Level 18, eh? Damn fake out. Earthquake does not affect me. You are defeated. Apart from your last Pokemon. 543 experience. Oh, Johto, you earned that, buddy. Ninkada! Okay. Hail Caesar! Level 16. Got a lot of nerve coming here. Bubble! So close. Bubble! That's a smaller bubble. Bubble! That's an even smaller bubble. Yeah! Take that, poo hole. Useless Pokemon. I hate the weak. Pokemon trainers, it doesn't matter. I hate seeing them hanging around. That goes for Team Rocket too. Think they're big and tough as long as they're in a group, but get them alone and they're weak. I hate them all. You stay out of my way. You won't be an exception if you get in my way. Look, see, that's a rival I want. I want someone that freaking hates my guts and hates everyone and just wants to destroy me. That's all I ask. Well, that was... I did not expect that. I'm sure you guys did, because you guys know the games inside and out constantly forever. And I wish I did. I wish I remembered my way around Johto. But that's where we're going to leave it for today. I'm going to try and work out a new method of doing shout outs for the people that really, really are only here because they want shout outs. And join me next time when I will continue a lovely epic journey through the beautiful Johto region. Beautifully remastered for Generation 4. I'm Ace Trainer Liam. Hit the subscribe button if you haven't already. If you're already subscribed, I love having you guys along with me for this adventure. But until next time, keep on training.